welcome back to my channel so in this video i will show you how to create longitudinal profile and cross-sectional profile of a river so first we need to know what is cross-sectional profile and longitudinal profile so longitudinal profile of a river depicts range in elevation of the channel bed over the entire length of the river from its origin to its mouth so here we have diagram of a longitudinal profile of a river so basically it's a graph which show you elevation along the river so now we have cross section of a river river cross profile show you a cross section taken sideways of a river channel or a valley at certain points in the river course so it's a graph across the river so this is the diagram so now we move to arc map to perform this analysis so for longitudinal profile we need to perform watershed analysis so here we used streams which we extract from watershed analysis so here we have watershed and these are the streams for longitudinal profile we use these drainage lines so first we open the arc toolbox so in arc toolbox we select 3d analysis tool and here we select the functional surface tool here we use the second of interpolate shape here first we input the dam then second we add the stream which we have extracted from the water like this option now we give the output name now click ok so we have got the output longitudinal profile so our next step is to i have already 3d analyst now add the 3d analyst tool and here we select after adding 3d analyst tool then we select any stream let's say we have select this stream now go to profile graph so basically this is the profile graph so basically this is the longitudinal profile of that stream along the river of the so our second part is cross-sectional profile of a river so we select the interpolate line and let's say we draw a line across the river double click here we profile graph so this is our cross-sectional profile of a river so the only difference between longitudinal and cross-sectional profile is along river and across the river profile <laughs>